Hello everybody, Mr. Hines here, flipping into another video. Today is a warm up video to make sure that you are ready for your day or anything for any kind of learning. But we are also going to do two physical challenges that you can try at home. Somewhat hard, somewhat easy. Let's get to that warm up. This warm up is brought to you by Go Noodle Play 60. Go check out Go Noodle. Alright, first thing we're going to do is punters. I call them toe touches. We're going to go up and touch our toe. They're also called Tin Soldier or Frankenstein. Let's do 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now let's turn it up a notch, make it a little bit more agile. Some agility here. We're going to do kickers. All it is. Nice and easy in front of you. Ready? Begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Getting that body warmed up. A little bit of a dance move right there. Going on to our next part of this warm up is heel grabs. All you're going to do is go give your heel a high five. Let's do another set of ten. Ready? Go. One, two, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna run in place, and when I jump, you're gonna jump. We're also gonna see how talented you are if you can tap the top of your head when you do it. Are you ready? We're gonna do this three times. Ready? Begin. We're running in place, running in place, and jump and tap your head. Let's go back to that run. Jump, tap the top of your head. One more time. Jump, tap the top of your head. We're gonna keep on moving here, but instead of touching our head, we're gonna touch our belly. Here we go, three times. Jump, tap your belly. Jump, tap your belly. We're gonna do this one more time. Jump, tap your belly. Woo, there we go. A nice smaller warm up today. Make sure that our body is ready. Our first challenge, let's get right into it, is going to be the arms locked challenge, fingers locked challenge. How this is gonna work, you're gonna start with your hands behind your back, but they're gonna be interlocked. Your fingers will be interlocked so you cannot take them apart. You're going to try to get your feet to go through to the front. Now Mr. Hines is still trying, still practicing all the time to make sure that I can do it as well. Now when you are here, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go forward through it, really working on that flexibility. And then getting that other leg through, and all the way back. You can try this multiple times if your hands come apart, like mine are starting to slip there for a little bit. Try to keep them as tight as possible if you would like. You may start in the front, going down, stepping through, hopefully a little bit better than I just did, and to the back. As you see, it's okay. Try your best though to keep those fingers interlocked. If you'd like to pause the video right now, try it a few more times. Now, our second challenge of the day is we are not gonna use our hands again, but we're gonna sit down, and roll over and stand back up without using our hands. Our hands are going to be behind our back, like so. I'm going to use a soft mat so that I do not uh, hit my legs or anything or head on the ground. So how this is going to work, you're going to get down. Trying to be as soft and careful as possible, like a worm almost. Now I'm on my belly. I'm going to roll all the way over. Without using my hands, I'm going to roll back though. Roll back so that I am on my belly. Now the goal here is to not use your hands and get up. Just like a worm. Right there, I just did not use my It's lunchtime here. We're going to continue on with this video. As you can see, I did not use my hands while getting up or down. If you'd like to, instead of being on your stomach, try to lay on your back. So 
So I want to get down again. Get up, get down, challenge. Going onto my back. And if I want, I'm going to try to stand up without using my hands. Sit on up. And roll on up. Those are two ways to try to get up, get down the challenge without using your hands. Now your body's warmed up, we did a few challenges. Hopefully they went a little bit better for you, especially with the finger lock challenge. I am super excited. Have a wonderful day. Stay positive, stay happy.